Hello Horrorlings, uh, welcome back to the channel and welcome It Lives Under You House. Oh my god, this game is going to be a spooky one and it's a sequel of I Live Under You House, which uh, you play a monster in a cave in this occasion. We are playing a human in the a monster's cave, so something to that effect. So yeah, that's going to be an interesting one, guys. Let's see it. Chapter 4, I am not a coward. Oh my god. The lights are out and the door is open. I don't like the look of this. Okay. All right, I'll just check to see if anybody's home. Okie dokie. Oh man, okay, we can move normally. Oh wow, um, we have the car as well in here. I wonder if we can go home, guys. Oh, I don't like the look of all this. Should I just leave? Should we just leave, guys? We have an option. Why not? Come on. Yes. Fuck it. I have seen enough shit in my life. Let someone else deal with it. Okay. Oh, and we got an achievement! Escape the DLC! Thank you for playing ending number 4. Okay, so obviously it's going to have different endings as well. That's quite interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay, so I'm a coward, but I'm not scared. So there you go. Oh man, I'm back again. Let's check the house and see what, what happened here. I'm not sure what the hell is going on here, but I love this. This is pretty, pretty cool. I wasn't expecting that actually. Very, very nice. Okay, so this is going to be the house, very obviously. And oh, ah, what a disgusting smell. What a disgusting smell indeed. Look at this place. It's blood everywhere. Shall we go from here first? Oh, blood in there as well. What's this? It is a human brain in a trash can. Wow, okay, something bad happened here. Good thing the window is open, or I would have suffocated in here. Oh, it's open, actually. So why he thinks it's open? Well, it is open. The window is open for the stage of this place. Look at this. Oh, man, oh, man. Okay, we have a basement. I can see already in that door. What's going on in here? Look at this. Oh, what the fuck is going on here? What kind of maniac would do this? Yeah, what kind of money I would do it indeed. Oh man, look at this place. Can we go in here? No, we can't. And we cannot go in there. The whole floor is sticky. It's sticky with blood. I don't even want to know what's happening here. The box is full of candles. Do we need the candles for anything, I wonder? Not too sure. Graphically, very PS1, guys. 1980s. Love it. Love it. That's my time, guys. Wait. Oh, my God. Good memories, sir. Oh, yes. Good memories. Um, okay. I'm guessing we need to go down the basement. So, there you go. With PS1 graphics and all. Oh, look. That looks uh, creepy. What the fuck is this place? Oh, man. Oh, man. Um, oh, I'm guessing we need to go in, it's just no more to it, so let's do it. There is a deep tunnel in front of me, with no end in sight. Are you sure you are ready to go into the tunnels? Oh, yes, please. Oh, man, this is super, super dark. Can we go back? I want to go home. No, we can't. We are going to have to face it, guys. Oh, press Z to grow. Oh, wow, that's strange. Z. Okay, that it is, or Z, as you guys call it in America, I think. Oh man, look at this place. What the hell is going on? What's this? Worker's helmet. Hell, if there is even the slightest chance that I belong to him, I can't turn back. Oh wow, okay. Uh, so, what's the storyline about, I wonder? Uh, obviously, we have to come down to search the house for something and then we found this a uh, tunnel and you know because we don't have anything else to do we just go in that would be great oh the tunnel seems to be getting narrower and narrower i was going to say very very claustrophobic i have to admit it looks really really dense and really spooky and claustrophobic oh god it really is no very nice place it's not um, I wish there was a tiny bit more light. Uh, the light, I think, is uh, way, way too dark, I think. The air is getting heavier to breathe. Okay. 
Uh, sound effects, very nice at the moment. I like it. Um, yeah, it's just a simple tunnel where we going and on and on and on. So, so far, that's what we're getting. Oh, what the hell is going on here? Oh, that's a very, very small entrance. It is so narrow, but I think I can get through. If I put a flashlight in my mouth and crawl like a worm, I think I can do it. Well, here we go. Press the spacebar. Oh man, okay. So we need to tap the spacebar until we go through. That's what we're doing. My arms are clapped at my sides. The only thing left to do is to push myself with my feet. Okay. Let's do that then. And I'm guessing that we are pushing and pushing. Oh man, oh man. Damn, it is getting harder and harder to breathe. But I don't have a choice anymore. I have to move forward. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. We can do this, guys. Oh, shit, shit. I think I'm stuck. I can't move. I am definitely stuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Well, it is what it is. What the hell are you doing in here? I don't want to die in someone's hole. I need to pull myself together. If I can push all the air out of my lungs, I can get through. Okay. That's what we're saying. That's what we're doing. I have one last push left and I'll get out of here. Come on, Excel. I can't believe I managed to get through. <laughs> no can I. No can I. Dude, why are you such a moron coming down here? And why are you here in the first place? Not to show. Oh, wow. I didn't like that sound behind my back. And you know what it is, do you? Oh, yes. We are absolutely blocked out now. We cannot get out. Can we? The passage is completely blocked. I'll have to find another way out. Shit. Oh, man. Okay. Well, shit indeed. Because we are in trouble, I think. Oh, man. I have to say, guys. Very, very nice little game so far. It's a very intense, claustrophobic, uh, yeah, environmentally horrific. You can see. Very, very cool little game. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, I'm guessing that we need to... Uh, Crouch again? Yes, we do. And the skull lies withered branches of flowers. It looks like a kind of totem. If you look closely, it is safe someone has scrapped the inscription in spirit on this stone. Looks like I have stumbled onto someone kind of cult or something. I hope the author of this work is a home. Well, I'm pretty sure something is going to be a home and we are not going to like it. Oh, that was creepy. That was creepy. Yeah, the sound effects, guys. Are cool, cool, cool. Oh, okay. I've never had a tripophobia, but this place makes me feel uncomfortable. It is different in appearance from other tunnels. I don't think it is being dark. I need to find a way out of here as soon as possible. Well, don't shit, Sherlock. That is exactly what I was thinking. Get out here as soon as we can. Just a bunch of pebbles. They're pretty smooth. Hmm. They're nice to hold. Well, you can get a bunch of them and take them with you, my friend. What can, what can I say? Okay, now we have a couple of options. Either we go up here. Or we go left down here. Um, not too sure. Shall we experiment a bit and explore? See what the hell is going on. Oh, we can go down there as well. Oh, well, okay. Um, not too sure where to go, guys, but... Uh, and, and Oh, what the hell is this place? Okay. Oh, hello, friend DLC, achievement unlocked. Very nice. So this is the Skull Collection. Okay. Okay, that tells me something. Can we sprint? No, we can't sprint. I'm guessing that we are crouching still, aren't we? Oh, wow, okay. Um, that changes things, then. Uh, I need to find the way in. That was the way in. Okay, so this is what it is. So I think we are going to go down here, guys. Oh, man. What are we going to find? Obviously, um, people have died in here, clearly, because we have helmets. We have found helmets in there. God knows what the hell is going on, but very, very interesting, very intriguing. Um, just following this um, terrible channel 
And I wonder if uh, we follow the sequel of the actual game. Supposed to be a monster down here. Oh, hey, no way out. So we need to go down here, I suppose. Yeah, you follow the sequel. Uh, it, it's supposed to be a, a monster down here. We are playing the human. Oh, man. Oh, wow. Do we drop? Uh, I'm guessing we need to drop. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Very, very interesting game. I love those PS1 graphics as well, guys. It makes sense. Oh, I feel like I am crossing the border into the afterlife. I had a similar feeling once before. Okay. It is definitely something magical about it all. It is like when I was a kid, when I was drawn to different abandoned buildings. Wow. I almost died once too. Back then, it was an abandoned hospital, a popular place for teenagers. Guys would go there, climb on the roof, smoke weed, and look at the stars. Wow. Well, not too sure about this. I didn't go to the roof. I was more interested in the basement. I even went there all by myself. Sometimes, walking through these tunnels, I could suddenly stop and turn off my flashlight. And so one day I stood once again in that darkness, listening to the wind walking through the tunnels. Suddenly, I heard a loud sound like a demonic scream. It was the scraping of metal mixed with a clash of granite blocks. It echoed throughout the corridors. I became unimaginably scared. I started calling for help, but there was no one to answer. But I got out, found a way out of the other side of the building. And when I went on outside, I saw that half of the building had collapsed. Several teenagers died. They were sitting on the roof when the building collapsed. Yeah, getting high as well. After that incident, I began to take more and more risk. I liked the adrenaline. I decided to become a police officer because it gave me the opportunity to be on the edge at all time. But these tunnels, there is something different here. I have never felt this way before. It excites me and frightens me at the same time. Wow, well, that was a hell of a editorial. Okay, uh, let's carry on. So we know a tiny bit more about the storyline and about the character, of course. Oh, man, oh, man. Okay, uh, where are we going? Oh, I feel the air has changed. So there must be a way out somewhere. Wow, oh, that's promising. Oh, man, oh, man. Okay, do we have... Uh, Oh, this is, this is, this is no way to go in here. I'm going to go from the left and try to figure out a uh, way to carry on. Uh, that looks to be it. Okay. And I'm going to use that pebbles as a reference where the hell I am, because in a minute it's so dark, I'm going to get lost. Uh, there's no exit here. Oh man, oh man. This is very, very creepy indeed. So the storyline, uh, well, but obviously the guy um, has some issues, as you can hear and see. Um, yeah, very dark past, I'm guessing that he's having. So it's pretty much psychological as well, uh, this little indie horror game, which I think is pretty cool DLC, actually. Okay. Oh, man. This opening is even narrower than the previous ones. I need to think carefully before I go in there. You know what? Well, we came all this way down. You are getting it, my friend. So there you go. Let's do the space bar tricky. And let's get squishing in between these rocks. I can feel fresh air coming from somewhere ahead. Okay, so let's carry on pressing. Oh man, this is a very interesting little game, guys. I'm loving it. This opening is even narrower than the previous ones. The main thing is not to panic like last time. Yeah, don't, don't do it. Don't scream like a baby. You decided to come in here, you got on with that, my friend. What was that? What was what? Oh, no, 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 no. Ah! Okay. Day zero, chapter five. I can only hope that my leg is not broken. Okay. The other leg seems to be free. Maybe I can push off with it. Okay, let's back again. Ah, what a pain. Fuck, it is no use. Oh, I'm stuck in here. Okay, for real, I'm stuck. I can't move, I can't do anything. 
Yeah, not too great, isn't it? Uh, I'm missing something here. I'm pressing a space bar. We are not moving. Help! Yeah, help. Uh, anybody around? It's a delivery service, maybe. <laughs> Somebody not to show. Oh man, help! Okay. Uh, I don't think uh, nobody's going to come down here to help you, my brother. I don't think so. I think that we are stuck in here. And unless this thing change, not too sure what the hell we are going to do. Because I'm trying, helping me. Five hours passed. How did they all start? Oh, wow, that's different. We are not in a cave anymore. I have been out of work for two months now. Yes, there were a couple of cases, but absolutely uninteresting. And he paid little. I even thought about going back to the service, huh? Of course, no one would take me back there. The whole town will never forget what I did. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing that uh, this is where he was uh, working as a police officer, maybe looking through cases or whatever. Not too sure. Then this man came in. All his kids shitless. He told me his name was John Nada. And he worked at a construction site far out of town. Nada told me that he worked with a friend whose name was Bob. So Bob went missing. Nada went to the police. The police refused to help him. He was not from around here, essentially a tramp. Nada did his job. The house was finished. He saved up money, and now he came to me. He just wanted to find his friend. I decided to ask around the owners of the house that Nada was building. Maybe they knew something, and here I am. No, I can't give up. I have to get out of here. Okay, we are back on the hole. So what was that? Thoughts, maybe? Yeah, reflection or something that happened. Come on. Is it painting, maybe, passing out? Not too sure. Not too sure, but very interesting. Very, very interesting. I'm not going to die in some hole. Yeah, you don't do in the hole of nobody's. You don't die in anybody's hole. You carry on, my brother. We are going to get you out of here. Oh man, the space bar, pressing, pressing, pressing. We are nearly there. It seems to be working. I'll be free. Mm. It worked. Ah, I feel so good to finally stretch out to feel the ground beneath my feet. What ground? Oh, this ground. Okay. Okay, so we need to carry on ahead, I'm guessing. And I'm hoping. Oh. Music. Music in horror games means trouble. Okay. I'm not too sure what's going on, guys. And I'm guessing that I'm going the right way because that music is creeping me out, guys. And I wonder if we're going to have a jump scare here at some point. Oh, man. I can't feel it coming. Oh, man. What do you think about the game? Leave me a comment below. Like, comment, and subscribe as well if you could. Yeah, for more of this lovely little horror games i'm loving them it's so so cool um let's carry on this is like a very endless tunnel see what happened uh shemu can sprint to make this happen a bit quicker but so far so good we carry on ahead nothing is happening nobody behind us i don't think so okay i played too many horror games to know that at some point Something is going to jump on me. Oh dear. And just waiting for it. This tunnel is awfully long. I'm missing something in here, guys. Am I missing something? That's the question. Oh, music stopped. Music. I got out. Achievement. Freedom at last. It is great to feel the ground beneath your feet. Stretch your arms out in different directions. The sun of the leaves. What happiness is to be outside. Okay. And there's no way I'm going back. There must be a road somewhere ahead. I have got to find help and get those damn cops to do the job. Okie dokie. So that means that we are going... What the hell is this? There's something in there. Oh, whoa, whoa, okay, we are starting. We are starting. Oh my god, what the hell is this? Is this an arm or a leg? This is my leg. Oh, wow. 
Fuck, I'm still here. I'm still here. I'm still here. Oh wow, yeah, well, you know, you get the idea. I hate this place. I hate rocks. I hate the dust. I hate that my whole body is stiff and I can straighten up. I just want to get up. I want to straighten my back. I want to bend my knee. Oh, how I want to bend my knee. My legs hurt so bad. I want to bend my knee. I hate uh, how I hate everything. Get me out of here. Somebody get me out of here. Help, help me, somebody. I will not be hurt. I will never be hurt. I'm stuck, stuck, stuck. Shit. Why did I come in here? Why did I come in here? What did I want? I wanted to help. I wanted to find this guy. That's all. Why did I call the police? Why did not I leave? I wanted to be a hero. I wanted to be useful. Fuck heroes. Fuck them. Wait, wait, wait a second with that, mate. Um... Yeah, we have a hero here, okay? We are trying very hard to do this video thing. So there you go. Nobody needs heroes here. Let's get stuck in holes and die. Not all of them. Usually something bad happens, but not all of them. I was going down into that dungeon like it was going into battle with a dragon. I was expecting a maniac here. I was expecting a horde of killers. I was ready to fight them. I was ready to defeat evil. This is what I had been, <laughs> what I had been prepared for. Not this hole, not this hole. Maybe I'm just an idiot, maybe that's what I wanted. Maybe I just wanted to die already because I was sick of everything. Because I don't have a job, because no one needs me. No one needs me, this place needs me. This hole needs me. I am tired. I'm very tired, my eyes are closing, I must rest. For 27 hours? Oh, wait a second. So you are finally awake. I have been waiting for you, though I think you have been waiting for me just as much. Who's there? Get me out of here. Come on, Nick. It is not all that fast and you like it here? You have been here so long I thought you liked this place. Screw you. Well, then I should probably go. No, 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 please stay. Help me. I am stuck here. Please don't go. Don't go. I am sorry. I'm sorry. Don't go. So it wants me to stay. It wants to get out here. Yes, please. I don't care who you are, what you did. I didn't see anything. Just get me out of here. Please. Please help. So it thinks I own the place. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm just a bystander. Let's just say the owner is away on family business. But you can't have a house with our master, can you? I can't get you out of here, but I'm going to need something from you. Anything, I'll give you anything, just cut me out of here. Anything? Bark for me, Nick. What? Yeah, what? Bark? I thought you were stuck, not deaf. Bark, bark for me. Does it want to get out of here? It has to bark. Wolf! Louder. Wolf, wolf. Louder, it should be dark. Louder. Wolf, wolf. Louder bark, whine like a wounded animal. Come on. Wolf, wolf, wolf. And he carries on barking and barking and barking and barking. Okay. Um, yes, bark. Bark and lose your name. From now on, you will lose everything. You will have no past and no future. Now, who the hell is this guy? You will become my creature persecuted by perpetual hunger and loneliness and you will serve us for 13 long years. In return, I will free you from these shackles of stone but your flesh will belong to us. Remember, your flesh belongs to us. I open my eyes and here I am, home again. What an unbearable feeling. Okay, and... What do we do, guys? Even though I have been here as long as I can remember, I hate every inch of these tunnels. This place disgusts me. I can't wait to get outside. Okay. The coolness finally. The air is so fresh. I like to listen to the crackling of the trees to enjoy this light whiff of the breeze on my skin. However, all this is only a moment. When I am distracted, my thoughts start to get confused. What are thoughts anyway? How do I know what thoughts are? How do I know the words? All these words just pop into my head on their own. And the more I try to understand where the source all of my knowledge comes from, the more it begins to hurt. 
I hung up against the ground inside me. It grows stronger and stronger. The voices in the tunnels tell me to kill the tenants of this house. But I don't want to do that, even though I am hungry. Wow, that is uh, strange. More and more I stop understanding myself. Something pushes me from inside to side, forces me to be in constant motion. But there are also moments like this when I stop. It seems to be going out for a walk. It is time to return to my underground and buffer before they see me. But I so want to stay here for just one more minute. Inhale. Exhale. Okay. There is no point in going back. And it will kill me. I have to do what I have to do. Still, I would rather not offend anyone. If only I had a choice. Oh, the end. Wow, guys. That was... Uh, that was pretty impressive, I thought. Very strange. Very, very strange game. Uh, cool. Very cool storyline. I love that. Uh, graphically, it looks okay. Uh, PS1 graphics, as we already said. Storyline, yeah, very nice, I think. Very, very strange. Very strange. So there you go. That was the indie horror game. Uh, I hope you liked it, and if you did, please like, comment, and subscribe, so I will see you in the next daily upload. Uh, until then, guys, take care.